Hey guys, Carolina Gamer here. Just going to show you um, what we have going on. As you notice, it is an HDMI console. We've got the LPT port wired up, and the diodes are wired up. Jumper. Diode. Um, this is the Xeno uh, Zephyr. Um, it also works on Falcons. This is the exact same way for Falcons and Opus. Opus, whatever you call it. Um, you'll have to connect up to here. You can actually connect on the bottom of the board as well. Um, but it's got all of the same features as the Xenon that I can tell. So we'll plug in our USB. We'll come over here to our controller. Power on. Look at the flashing light. And then that's what we want. Then we'll come up here. Yeah, I know. PlayStation 2. Get off of it. Bad console, I agree. But. Oh well. We're on the 360. It's a kiosk. That's what we got here. Uh, I'm just going to do a quick load. This is. Uh. SNES emulator. Um, it's running via red, green, blue composites into the back of the television. Wow, didn't even try that. Balance it with one hand, playing just like that. Um, but yeah, it's the Zephyr. Now, a majority of all consoles can be, you know, able to run Zell Linux. Um, you know, it's still going. But, yeah, it's the console. And again, this is a Zephyr. So, you know, I have some better pictures, uh, installed pictures of this later on. Um, everything else is the same way. LPT is hooked up the same exact way. This right here is the only difference. Um, they're just going to different points. Um, but, yeah, there you go. Again, Carolina Gamer, follow me on Twitter. Carolina Gamer, YouTube, subscribe rate five stars and uh carolina gamer is out